up until this point, you've, where the, the industry has been dominated by the big, big incumbents who have, often cases, internal real estate departments, they're very well funded, and they'll purpose build massive facilities, okay? But then move to the other end of the spectrum, where you've got the smaller food companies who don't have those kinds of resources, don't have the capital to commit to their own build or a long, long-term lease. Well, and, and because they're small, they're poorly represented. There's not a lot of people servicing them or want to service them. So there's the gap. There, there's the gap and they're growing. And so I want to focus on helping those guys land in the kind of space that's right for them. They're often just stuffed into something that's a modification let's say tool and die, that's no longer tool and die space. Now these guys are stuffed into, uh, you know, sort of having to tweak a tool and die space to accommodate food processing, which is also strict, has strict requirements about regula regulatory compliance at a provincial and federal level, and that gets pretty tough. It doesn't work. So I think to start purpose building spaces that complies with exactly their needs will do these companies a, a world of good.